taking care of business along with Vince Vaughn and Tom Wilkinson. Dave Franco stars in the new movie Unfinished Business and he joins us live from London this morning to talk about the movie. Dave, brother of Tom Franco, good morning. <laughs> I appreciate that. Let's give Tom Franco some love. Yeah, show Tom him some Franco love, man. Tom Franco is the superior Franco <laughs> brother. Everyone know that Tom is the most handsome, the most talented, the most charming, the sweetest. Tom Franco's the one. Yeah, and his Firehouse Art Collective in Berkeley. Throw him some love right now. There it is. We said it. Absolutely. <laughs> I love this. This is my favorite interview. <laughs> Glad I could start off on a good note. Hey, man, you're having a good, say, year and a half. You had Neighbors, and then you have uh, the, the next movie you did after Neighbors. Uh, you had Now You See Me in 2013. You had Neighbors in 2014, and now you have this comedy. You, you must feel like you're on a roll right now. Your agent must be just getting all kinds of offers for you. I've been I've been very lucky, my man. Uh, it's uh, it's one of these things where I've I've tried you know I've tried my best to be patient and and wait around for uh, projects that I I feel really passionate about. And like I said, it's it's been a lot of a lot of luck falling into these things and just kind of being able to surround myself with people who are a lot funnier than I am yeah. and who who make me seem a lot funnier than I actually am. And so. Uh, I'm crossing my fingers just because this stuff doesn't always last, but I, I, I feel very fortunate, yeah. Well, you already, you already have a sequel with Now You See Me coming. I can't wait to see it because that movie was, uh, for me, a surprise hit, and it was a great film uh, that Now You See Me, so we can't wait to Thanks, see that man. one. Uh, let's talk about this one. You have Tom Wilkinson, who is a well-respected actor, and I think you actually get to smack him, <laughs> so does it get any better than that? And also Vince Vaughn, who's been knowing what he's doing for a while. Tell us a little bit about Unfinished Business. Yeah. Yeah, so uh, the movie's about the three of us uh, going on a business trip to Berlin where we are trying to close a deal that we've been working on for a year. And, of course, when we get there, everything that can go wrong does go wrong. And uh, it was really great working with those two, as you can imagine. Like, uh, Vince, someone who I've looked up to for a long time, just in terms of uh, just in the, in the comedy world. And he, he was so great, you know? He's one of these guys who... He's genuinely just as funny mm -hmm. offset as he is on, and uh, he, again, he really raises your game, and he, uh, he's a very giving comedian as well, where he was, you know, he would pitch me jokes to say. Right, he, would, right. he would tell me, he would be like, all right, um, that joke that you're saying, just add this tiny little thing and see oh, what nice. happens. And most of the time, it was a lot funnier than we, what we initially had, and so that was incredible. And then Tom Wilkinson, yeah. like you said, like, just an absolute pro. Uh, two-time Academy Award nominee mm -hmm. just doing bong hits during, in, during this movie and, uh, <laughs> dancing around doing you know with naked girls doing yeah. a pillow fight he and, means on screen uh, everybody he it, means on screen yeah <laughs> right absolutely uh, <laughs> and uh, no he's Tom Tom's one of my favorite people he's he's such a he's like we say he's such a good actor that it doesn't matter how big mm -hmm. the comedy is sometimes, he's gonna ground it and make it feel real. So I, I love that, man. Now, you, you're doing your thing, you're handling your business in your own right. Uh, do you, did you ever think of not using your last name? Use your first and middle name, because people immediately associate you with your brother. Do you ever think of, I just, I'll just be, right. you know, change your name? That's a great question, actually. It might be too late now, but it's definitely something to consider. Uh, it's tough, you know? It's, it's one of these things where uh, it, it really is uh, a blessing and a curse, you mm -hmm. know, where he, he did help me find a manager when I first started out, which I don't take for granted. You know, that's not just, uh, that's not an easy thing to get. And so, but from there on out, it's like no one was gonna hire me just because I'm James Franco's Absolutely. little brother. And I didn't want anyone to, you know? I wanted right. to pave my own path. But it's been, it's been, it's tough because, uh, you know, for the past almost 10 years, uh, most interviews mm -hmm. and auditions and meetings I go in on, you know, people, people ask about him and it's like, I love him to death and I respect him so much, but I'm my own person and, uh, yeah, you, are, you know, man. we, we may look similar. May, yeah. Thanks dude. We may look similar, but like, uh, I think people are starting to maybe see at least a little bit that we have very different things to offer. And I hope that becomes even more apparent. Well, as an entertainment reporter and critic, I'll just tell you, keep doing what you're doing and it'll be, you know, uh, James will be, he is your brother. He always will be, but uh, keep doing what you're doing and you'll do right. your thing, man. You are. So thanks for the time. Thank you so much, dude.
All right, Unfinished Business is the name of the film. It opens nationwide March the 6th. And I have to say, it is a 20th Century Fox film. And since we're sitting at Fox 2, so. He's my favorite, Baldwin. <laughs> <laughs>